to the Mum's Eye View channel. I am Rebecca Meldrum and today I am back with some packed lunch inspiration. Whether you are returning to school after the summer holidays, going back to work and need to take a packed lunch, or if you have a child starting school for the first time like me, then I am going to show you three different packed lunch options to give you a little bit of inspiration. So let's have a look. So in the first packed lunch I've decided to make a tortilla wrap with cheese and ham inside. They're super easy and just a little bit more exciting than a sandwich on a day-to-day -day basis. The fruit that I'm adding for this packed lunch is a pineapple lolly. These are an absolute genius idea. They are washed and ready to eat, perfect snack sized size um, and I just think they're perfect for kids and adults that want to have a little pineapple fix through the day. These are just great for popping in the packed lunch. They're pre-packaged so there's no mess and they're perfect size for little hands to hold and they're just so cute. I'm going to be adding some sugar snack peas. My daughter absolutely loves snacking on these. She eats them whole as well as opening them up and eating the peas individually out of them. They're a really cute little snack for them, easy to manage um, and full of goodness. I'm just going to pop a handful of them in there. I also have some pesto hummus and I'm just going to decant it into a little pot and add it into the pack lunch for my daughter to dip the sweet peas in. I'm just going to add a cute little fromage frame and a spoon. And there we have it. That is one packed lunch ready to go. We have the tortilla wrap with ham and cheese. We have a pineapple lolly. We have pesto hummus, sugar snap peas, a fromage frame and a big old drink of water to keep her going. Okay, so for day two, we are going pretty simple today. There is no sandwich making involved. I have decided to sensify it with a sausage roll, some carrot sticks. This is um, like one serving, but it is quite large, so I don't think Sophia will make her way through them, but they are there if she wants them all. Pesto hummus again to go with the carrots. We have this super cute little pack of watermelon slices. They are washed and ready to go. Two little slices in there, and Sophia absolutely loves watermelon. I'm gonna pop in another yogurt for her again. And just as a little sweet treat, I've got these mini chocolate animals. And that is day two. Today I'm going a little bit more old school and making a sandwich. It's not actually going to be just any sandwich though. I picked up these super cute um, cookie cutters and I'm just going to use them to make this sandwich into a really cute shape. There's something about shaped sandwiches that kids just absolutely love. And there we go. And I'd, I'll probably eat that for my lunch. It's like a standard mum lunch, isn't it? The leftovers of your child's nicely shaped sandwiches. Today's fruit is melon and grapes. They are again washed and ready to go. And today's veggies are going to be cucumber sticks. I'm just gonna pop them in like this to keep them all together. And again, I'm gonna pop that in with some hummus that I've decanted into a smaller pot. Some chocolate animals again, and a yogurt. And there you have it, three days worth of packed lunch inspiration. What is your child's favorite thing to go in a packed lunch? Leave it in the comments below. And obviously these could be taken to work for adults as well. So if you are an adult going to work, then what is your favorite thing to take in your packed lunch? I need some more inspiration. We have a lot of school days to fill and I'd love to hear what you guys send in yours. Thanks for watching guys. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and click subscribe. And I will see you all very, very soon.